Right everybody, welcome back to some building in Street Legal Racing Redline. Today I'm finally doing the Starlet. Now, <laughs> can we reach five stars? This is this is not the name he's been going by for uh for you know forever. I know him as other names, but currently that's his name. Uh, he's been asking me for the fucking Starlet for so goddamn long, for probably years by now. Years year maybe. And uh, I'm gonna admit I've been a bit of a I've been a bad person. I just keep forgetting that I promised to do it. I keep forgetting, and here we are, guys. Here we are today. This is specially for you, my guy. Specially for you. The latest comment right now, 10 hours ago, waiting for the starlet. This is it for you, my guy. This is the st we're building the goddamn starlet today. We are on SLRR uh, Ultra LE. Link in the description. Very good. As you can see, this is the M5 was supposed to here, but it disappears. So whatever, uh, still disappears. But Today we're doing the goddamn starlet, and I'm, I'm I'm doing it. I am doing it. Let's go and check it out. Here it is, the goddamn starlet, the goddamn starlet. Now I don't know if this is the exact starlet you want to make, uh, you want me to make. Uh, you did not specify, and I do not know the starlets too well, the Toyota starlet. I do not know them too well to know if there are other starlets. But this thing, this boxy little thing, I'm gonna make. I love that already. Love the the mirrors. I'm gonna make this thing fucking wild. So the car came with no, no, no tires or rims. That is no wheels. That is that's perfect because we don't need that. Because we'll be throwing some nice. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna make this car stands, boy. I'm gonna make this car clean, clean. It's gonna be a clean car. But let's get right into it with some suspension modifications. So there will be nothing surprising this time. And um, um, Mr. Sir Two's and Greedy Type S. Uh, fucking things shock absorbers yes uh, same with the springs we've got the car is gonna get a big brake kit because it's gonna be it's gonna get a, a bigger engine it's gonna get a good engine this car okay we've got 278 uh, millimeter Brembo's in the front slotted that's good and normal big brit the back, uh, I mean they're still pretty big but normal this on the back we got we got a project MU because they look cool and brake black brake calipers on the rear because they look cool now i've got some wheels going okay i've got some wheels but they are not the final thing they may be they very well may be because they look good honestly this car might e might even take 18s hmm this car might even take 18s we'll see later for now this is just a something to keep the car on some kind of wheels although the rear end is already it's already a bit oof on the rear end but that is fine Let's see what we can do about the engine because right now we have, um, we don't have an engine. This is like fucking an illusion. This is stupid. So we're going to do something good about the engine, and I don't know what that is still. Huh. So I'm currently stuck with a, between a few engines. Don't don't look how many of them there are. There's just different variations. So we've got a B16 VTEC, which would be cool. Uh, none of these will actually. Oh I, oh shit. The SR20 will actually fit. Okay, so the car disappeared again after a crash. I'm just gonna do a quick test. Let's just buy a random Levine and random A86. Leave, load the career again. Right, I'm going to a different uh, mod pack. This is not gonna work, is it? <laughs> the cars just keep disappearing. So, we are SLRR by Bra HD. Libra. Lebra HD SL, SLR LE uh, V3 link in the description for this one as well I guess um, this uh, things work here <laughs> the cars don't disappear so everything is absolutely exactly the same except these are 18 inches not 17 inches and on the front end it just kind of looks like it can eat like at 19 but I think we're good with 18s I think we're good with 18s um, everything is absolutely the same so let's try the engine again for the third time second time fuck okay so uh, second time's the charm, of course. We have a few different engines. I've got a RS500 Cosworth engine, which is a four-cylinder turbo. Wow, that's a nice fucking model, dude. Look at that. That's amazing. A Cossie engine. Well, that's a, it's a bit of a big of an intercooler, isn't it? Oh, but it's okay. It's a rally car. Um, honestly, this, this does fit when we push it backwards. This does fit, but obviously it's not really meant for this car it's really not meant for it i got i'm gonna change the front trailing arms because that's not that does not look good but we have that we have a we got a variety of 
uh, of SR20s which fit less but also have an amazing look SR20s are cool SR20s so we have an SR20 DET this, this does not fit even though I put everything fit okay and we've got a 4G 63 not fully built okay that's cool huh okay all right I don't even know what's happening SR20 DE so we have a NA SR20 but I don't think we want that how much power was, would an NA SR20 make 224 hor horsepower that's a lot actually I don't, I don't believe an SR20 NA SR20 makes 200 uh, horses man I just don't believe that I have a another SR20 a more rugged turbo SR20 without the turbo and a lot of intercooler piping and another one this is very stock this looks like a KA even even though know, it's I mean it says it's a, it says it's an SR20 well how much power does this thing make man how much power is this thing okay 300 I don't believe that for a second I think it would be most appropriate to use a 4G 6 for for a GE 4 a GE engine as since it's a Toyota it's an old ass Toyota that would be appropriate that would very much be appropriate but we must see if we can build this engine up because if not I'm throwing an SR20 on. The Cosworth is very cool, but it will not be as good of a click clickbait title. Title? Click bait title. Not even clickbait. No, it's gonna it's not gonna be a good uh, enough uh, title. So I'm gonna see if I can do something about the Hor G sixty three. And uh I'll be right, so we've got we've got a we've got a good looking uh well that's not good looking, but we can fix that. That's every, everything like these things are fixable. Uh, that is not going to be the final position of the engine, so download and whatnot. But we've got a 4G63, 4G, 4, 4AGE, <laughs> not 4G63. That's complete. Oh, this is an Audi S5. I just noticed that. Whatever. What kind of power is this thing? This, it doesn't run. Ha! I thought it was going to run. Not going to lie. <laughs> it's missing. The alternator is missing the drive belt. Good, good, not good. So there's the alternator, right? And here is the alternator drive belt. It's an HKS one. It doesn't work. It says no. Oh, maybe. It still says no. I'm missing something somewhere. I mean, considering. Fucking, I don't. I don't know why it's not working. I don't know why it's not working, though. Alright, it was just a different type of alternator, HKS still, it was just a different type of uh, alternator drive belt. There's also a supercharger, but I've got no idea how to install that. I've, I've, I've been trying things here, things there, but none of it really worked. Camshaft bearing bridge, what the fuck kind of thing is this, man? It literally comes with no parts. Alright, alright. While we are here, I've got HKS camshafts and uh, an exhaust camshaft. Camshaft. So uh, that's good. So we've got the bearing bridge, perfect. And then this, and in theory, hey, the car starts amazing, amazing, perfect, 210 horsepower. <laughs> Fuck it, dude. It's uh, that's a lot of horsepower for me for GC. This car is a bit heavy, isn't it? Doesn't matter. This is not supposed to be some kind of street racing machine. This is just supposed to be a cool car. And I think we have managed that with this engine, which sits very low. It's extremely low. Why don't you fucking stay stay center? Uh, sure, go back a bit, and then just fucking disappear up there, and we are good. Yep, that's good. That is good. Well then, we have we have uh, succeeded in doing that. I really want to change the, the trailing arms though. Yeah, I'm gonna try and do that because I don't like how it looks. Okay, so I've got a bunch of these. I've got <laughs> I've got Viper struts, which actually look good. We got Viper. We have Mr. Sir V ones that still. Oh shit! The Viper also is uh, fucking double wishbones, and we've got the V stands. Yeah, I'm gonna go with V stands because it's just the cleanest. It's not. It's gonna. It's not. It's not gonna show. That's the problem. It just keeps showing. These things just show underneath the car, and that's not good. Oh my 
God, that's disgusting. Why did it... Oh, fuck, I need to fix that later. I need to fix that later. That's fine, that is fine. So let's go on to the next part. This has been way too long. So, first things first, we got a paintable front bumper. And now things start getting wild. We have a wide array of front splitters. Okay, can we mix and match now? Right, uh, okay, this this one, as you can see, is for one of these things. Because this, ga this car has a bunch of white body kits. This is, oh, wow, that's disgustingly wide. It's way too wide. Let, we're not, we, I'm not going to go with that much wideness. Oh, wow, that's... We're going to go with something cleaner because we, we got. I want the cleanest wide, so they just become great. Okay, this is yeah. I'm gonna go with a bit of wide. It's gonna it's gonna have a bit of wideness. Y you know, you gotta do it. You gotta do it. Ah, this this one's good, but it just goes for the wide bumpers, and we don't have that. Okay, that's good. That is a good splitter. We've got a nice roll cage in the back as well. Why not? We don't want anybody sitting in our uh, starlet in the back. We don't want that. Oh, I like that. Shit, I like that one. Bumper holders. Rally mud flaps. They, they, these won't do for the simple reason that the car will be much wider than those mud flaps and they won't be doing anything. So, I'm going to go and throw on the this splitter, I really like that, and I'm going to throw on this thing. Where is it? Oh, these are tow hooks. Okay. The fucking oil cooler sticking out the front. All right, all right. This car is getting this, this car is getting wild. All right, this car is getting wild. So I'm going to get to get the paintable rear bumper as well, because we need that. And uh, that's a front splitter. Rear tow hooks. I guess we already have the tow hooks. Yeah, we already have the tow hooks, that's cool. Front under bumper. What the fuck is an under bumper? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that so it's fine. So is there no rear splitter, rear under bumper, rear, rear lip? We have a rear bump. Okay, yeah. So there is no rear modifications. That's, that's fine, that's fine. Let's see what we else what we can find. So, I've got a bunch of... we got a wing. Let's see the wing. Oh, oh, that looks nice. That looks fucking nice, man. That looks very nice. Alright, so I've got a bunch of, you know, small parts, small additions with a lot of fucking... Hell yeah, today I'm going to be trying and getting a nice looking bumper. Uh, not bumper, a license plate. Because license plates are cool. And we're going, I'm, I need to fix the, the suspension because it's fucked. And get a nice exhaust boy. And get a paint, so... In reality, next 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 cut will be the reveal of this car because I am genuinely excited about this car. I actually like it. I'm very sorry that I not did that I'm that I I did not make it. Fuck! What the fuck was that? Did I get a stroke? I did not make it earlier because this is this is a pretty cool build. I'm not gonna lie, this is a pretty cool build. So, uh, yeah. All right, guys, are you ready? Because I'm actually pretty fucking excited about this build, genuinely. I've been tweaking about for quite a while and um, this is it. Now the paint, you might be like, what is this paint? I was going for I was going for gold, but I realized I'm not gonna find anything goldy looking in this game. So I went with this brown orange goldy looking thing with some black grayish accent on the wheels. I've kept the wheels because I like them. Look at the fitment, the fitment is nasty. We got the oil cooler, we got the black uh, the black splitter so you can see the nice plate which is bent perfect look at it oh my god we got the interior we got a half half a um, half a row bar with some Recaros and a nice gnarly wheel on it so it's, it's serious shit serious shit look at this and on the back I went for big twins right smack down the middle of the car. I was thinking, I was testing shit, and I do like how this looks. It's, it's, it's like it's fitting for a car this small. It is fitting for a car this small with the... It's got it's got the the beautiful 4 AGE. And, I've, and if I do say so myself, this is... This is a pretty sick build. This is a pretty sick build, if you ask me. Look at this thing. Oh my god, that's a, that's nice. That's definitely nice. Maybe slightly bigger wheels, but we're going for uh we don't we don't need that. We don't need that. That's this is good. This is good. Now 
I should probably test it out just 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 for the sake of testing it out. So we're taking the car out for a nice weekend drive. Oh that's a nice look man, that's a nice look. Can we That is a nice look. I like this car. I like this car. Oh. I just wanted to take a screenshot, but this also works. We just entered the garage. Hell yeah, it's I, I like this. How do I exit the garage now? Okay, there we go. Let's let's see how the car does. I mean, the car has an extremely wide track. We've got a 300 horsepower 4G for a 63 for a GE. And if I do say so myself, I, I do like how this car. Okay, well, maybe not taking that corner that fast, but this is the car actually just feels pretty stable on the ground, considering the amount of uh, fucking how wide everything is. Oh shit! This is I mean this is real wheel drive. Let's not forget that the car is indeed real wheel drive. Help! It's okay. It's okay. Car is indeed real wheel drive. Man, this car is pretty fucking sick. Okay, this car is really sick with a wide body, just standing, all powerful and mighty. Oh shit! Let's not do anything stupid to the car. But yeah, to, I, I'm sorry, my guy. I'm sorry that it took me so long to make this car. But I can tell you with certainty that I quite enjoy this car. This little mean machine. Look at it. Oh my god, such a mean little car. But Guys, thank you for watching this episode and I will see you in the next one.